Nine wins was the standard when Nebraska senior class arrived on campus. The group would try to get the Big Red back to that mark this afternoon against Maryland. Led by backup quarterback Riker Fife, the Huskers wasted no time taking control against Maryland. The Grand Island native led scoring drives on each of the Huskers' first two possessions. Then the Big Red doubled its lead to 28 points by the end of the third quarter. Nebraska cruised to its most lopsided win in conference play. Terrell Newby had a season-high three touchdowns, helping the Huskers improve to 9-2 on the season. The Big Red was a fourth-quarter score away from their first shutout since 2009. Nearly all the seniors had a hand in today's win, and the players say Sam Fultz was there with them in spirit. 10-11's Joe Musa reports on the powerful pregame scene at Memorial Stadium. On Tuesday, head coach Mike Riley described the tribute to Sam Foltz as perfection. The crowd on hand here at Memorial Stadium was treated to exactly that. Players walked out to the 27-yard line and placed a single rose on a flag paying tribute to their fallen teammate. He means the world to us and, um, you know, there's any, anything we can do to, you know, keep his legacy alive and uh, it touched a lot of us and then, you know, seeing Jill and Gerald out there. Um, it was real emotional. Sam, we love you. Uh, still, still hurts this day, obviously. Uh, we, we miss Sam like crazy, and, and uh, you know, we, we love him so much, and, and he's still out there with us. I mean, Sam, Sam was a brother to us, you know what I mean? He's one of our, one of our best friends, so, um, you know, to, to celebrate, you know, all of us moving on in the next phase of our lives and knowing that Fulci's, you know, out there watching us. It's just, you know, it's a very emotional time. I knew it was going to be a tough day, a lot of emotions, and, um, you know, obviously this should be a game that I should be walking out with Sam for my last game. But, uh, you know, I knew he was with us, with me in spirit. So, uh, you know, it was nice seeing Jill and Gerald, his parents, before the game. They talked to me and gave me a hug and said, he'll be with you out there, just go out and play hard. This season, Sam's presence could be felt everywhere, and that continued today. His high school teammate, Riker Fife made his first career home start for the Huskers, leading them to the 28-7 victory. Reporting from Memorial Stadium, Joe Musso, 1011 Sports. Now, Bray, during the pregame tribute to Fultz, a stray balloon descended onto the field. It came to a surprising rest on the 27-yard line. Well, Nebraska.